about reaching the world for Jesus Christ. It is what God has called us to. It is the high value. It is the mission for our life together. It's why, it's why we exist. That, that one day every single living, breathing person will know Jesus Christ is Lord. It is the mission, the goal of the church. It is what we are about. People look at the church one of two ways. It's either a force or it is a field. And I'm telling you, this is the reality of how people all across America tend to look at the church one of two ways. If the church is a field, then we fence it off and we protect our crops and we do our thing on our field in our turf and we try our best to just keep everything clean and tidy. And every person who is deployed in ministry, every single person who's here in the church, they all have a ministry to the church. Because this is where the ministry happens, in the field. It all happens here. Everything happens here. So whatever your gifting, whatever your passion, you're doing it all right here in the field, right in the field. That's where ministry happens. Oh, we may pay some money to send two people out here. We don't understand them. We call them missionaries. They're so odd. They go away, and we can't figure them out, so we send them out, and hopefully they can do a little field over here and a little field over here. But we don't, we don't understand what they do, so we just hope they build their own little field. And, and, we, and we'll literally pay them. We'll give them a dollar to go do it. We don't pay them well. I didn't say that. We'll give them a dollar. Here, go do that. I heard that everybody lives below poverty there anyway. It's third, third world country, so you won't need much. So we'll just, let, we'll, just, we'll just keep you poor too. Sorry, I just had energy there, and I know it revealed. <laughs> it, I know it revealed that's not how I think the church ought to be. So those of you that were thinking, yeah, that's right. That's the church. I'm like, Argh. The other way to look at the church is a force where the church is going into the world. And, and we're not paying somebody else to go. We're going into the world. We are deployed. We're following the great commission, the, 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 the call of Christ. Go into all the world and make disciples. And so, so here, here, now watch what happens. Here, people who are deployed, they're, they're shooting out into ministry. They're, they're going all over, all over the community. They're going to the, the, the ministry centers here in town close by and further and further and, and we're going all the way to India but this is what most of us do we're going into the world to make disciples oh yes there are some God calls to stay yeah. you know here's a person and, they, and, and they're staying they're doing ministry here all in, inside kind of the you know because because we got hundreds of children the need to learn about Jesus. And so we bring all our children, and then we all praise, don't we all praise God? The kids are downstairs. <laughs> we'll pray, thank you, Jesus. And we, we don't understand it, but there's someone who actually feels called by God to work with children. My wife is like that. I say, what are you doing? <laughs> but you see what I see? Here, here what, what is it? Let's say, let's say this, is, this is what, 20%? Of the people that, that, that go, 80% stay, huh? That'd be right? Well, here, here, 80% are deployed. And maybe 20%. You gotta have 20% here. It's not a lesser ministry to, to teach our children about Christ. It's not a lesser ministry to do work here in the church for our students and teenagers and let, help them build faith not a lesser ministry to do a small group ministry here or to run cameras so you can all see there's nothing inferior about that it's just let's recognize god calls when you read the bible give away my bias again if you read the bible you discover god calls most of us out and some of us in to nurture and equip and teach right this is a this is a perversion of the scriptures you don't see that anywhere in the Bible. 